This is Wilmington's Thieves of the Week. Welcome back to Thieves of the Week. Let's get right to it. The suspect pictured here attempted to cash a check with a fake ID belonging to a dead person at the First National Bank on South College Road. That's pretty low, dude. Unfortunately, this happens and is why you need to protect your identity and the identities of your loved ones. You get bottom feeding people with no morals who will steal at any cost. Some people have zero self-respect and wouldn't know dignity even if they stole it. The suspect here stole from Wilmington Area Intergroup on Wrightsville Avenue on June 27th. Take a good look and if you recognize the subject, give us a call. These two women were involved in a theft at Flea Bodies on Market Street. We're doing our best to identify them, but need your help. Let us know if you know who they are. The lady picture here stole merchandise from Walmart on Sigmund Road on June 23rd. Call us now if you can identify her. This subject stole from Academy Sports on Gingerwood Drive on June 14th around 2.45 p.m. If you know who she is, use tip 411 or give us a call. And now for our Thief of the Week, take a good look at this suspect vehicle that was driven by a subject who stole an air conditioning unit from a residence on Dawson Street back on June 30th. The vehicle does not appear to have a registration plate displayed and is known to frequent the area of Cypress Grove Apartments, so be on the lookout. The suspect has been listed as a black male, 5 foot 10 inches, age 35 to 40 years old. We all know it's been a hot summer thus far, but let's be real. We know you didn't steal the air conditioner because you're hot and you want to cool down. The little bit of money you'll get from some of the materials isn't worth thousands of dollars that'll end up costing you and the taxpayer in court costs and everything else associated with it. The desire for instant gratification and problems with impulse control can cause problems for some folks. Learn to handle it. Every decision in life has a consequence and it's the bad ones that you don't want. That's this week's Thieves of the Week. Remember, when you steal in our city, we put you on the internet and the internet is forever.